Hello and welcome by the Orchid Saga. So yeah, this is a tag video because I have been tagged by Joshi from Orchids by the Lake. And the tag is, uh, what is my weirdest orchid that I have in my collection? Uh, so um, first of all, uh, Joshi, thank you for the tag. I really appreciate it. Uh, so I, yeah, I had a bit of a thought about uh, what I found weird. Uh, which is something I basically also discussed with Hillbilly Arcade. She was tagged in the same video as well by Jossie. But I said, yeah, well, for me, uh, weird is very close um, to fascinating, actually. So some things I found weird and thereby, like I said, also fascinating. So, um, but yeah, anyhow, the tag is about, uh, about uh, my weirdest Arcade. And what I found sort of kind of weird is uh, the resting uh, orchids. I'm not going to choose a Dendrobium nobly, but it's, for me it's very strange that that's somehow very weird uh, that a orchid can just basically stop growing. And this is what we uh, call the winter rest. And there it, it reacts to uh, temperature and to light and then starts to grow again. So yeah, that, that's kind of weird to me. Uh, but the blooms are not very weird for me on the nobly type, so therefore I don't choose them. Although, of course, they not really have a spike, but just the butts uh, on the cane. And, and just this one is just starting to bud here. I hope you can see it. This is my uh, first nobly for this uh, season. Well, actually it's a bit, a bit uh, early, but anyhow. So yeah, the blooms are very beautiful, so that's... Be that's why I didn't choose them as my weirdest, but over here we have more. And I'm sorry you guys for that mess, because it's watering day. And I'm just testing out, so this is probably for another video if it works or not. But anyhow, <laughs> that's why I have so many uh, stuff uh, here in my greenhouse currently. But you also have the ca uh, catechidium types, which I found uh, weird as well. And those are going to lose the leaves. And well, actually here is one. It's just coming off very easily, as you can see. <laughs> um, and then you are left with a strange bulb in the end. But first, if you're lucky, they start to bloom. And if you really are lucky, they make two spikes like this one. And then again, they have these beautiful shaped blooms, which I not really found very weird, a bit, bit different than the rest. So that's why I didn't choose these either, but now we are getting there. This is, I think, my weirdest orchid. It's basically the same type of, uh, not, not really the same type, but it goes through the same growing uh, rhythm as a catechidium. It is going to be dormant as well. Uh, it's uh, losing the leaves, as you can see, this is the bulb, uh, previous bulb. Um, and then it starts uh, to grow first of the, of course, the leaves in summer, in spring, and then also uh, starts to bloom. And I must admit, <laughs> these blooms are kind of weird to me as well. Beautiful, fascinating, but also weird. They, they remind me of a propeller or something, of a helicopter, <laughs> I don't know. It's strange, but um, weird and, and fascinating and beautiful as well. But yeah, if I really had to choose, I would choose my Lacaste, uh, no ID, and I call it white, as my weirdest orchid with these beautiful long leaves. But they are not here for, for that long and then they will uh, start to go as well. And it starts the whole process over, uh, pro process over again. So yeah, this is probably my weirdest orchid. And then, of course, I have to uh, tag uh, people. Well, first of all, I'm going to tag Inse, Inse Schaap, from Inse Orchids and ADD. So Inse, I hope you uh, have a uh, strange weird orchid in your collection. Well, actually, actually, I think you have. You just need to have a weird orchid. Um, so that's my third, first tag. And my second tag will be uh, Matthew from uh, Hello Plant Lovers. Uh, I'm not sure if you were tagged already, but uh, if you didn't uh, already have been tagged, Matthew, uh, well, I'm going to tag you now. So the tag is all about the weirdest orchid in your collection. 
and I cannot wait to see which ones you will choose. And of course, for all of you guys there, thank you so much for watching. I hope you uh, like this video. And of course, I really hope to see you at one of my next uh, videos. Bye-bye.